algorithms sorting offered by Stanford Crowd Cowers Initiative. Classification of sorting algorithms. Traditionally, sorting algorithms are classified according to their main operational characteristic rather than their underlying logic. Traditionally, algorithms are discovered first and then probed correct. Sorting algorithms are no exception. The work in program uh, synthesis uh, has been applied to the derivation of algorithms for their specification. The main advantage of this approach is that correctness is usually automatically built in. For the programming logic, we have these three. The goals and properties of sorting algorithms. Approaching sorting. Sorting is ordering a list of objects. We can distinguish the two types of sorting. If the number of objects is small enough to fit into the main memory, sorting is called internal sorting. If the number of objects is so large, that some of them reside on the external storing during the sort, it's called uh, external sorting. Sorting algorithms are often mm, classified by computational complexity, worst, average and best behavior in terms of the size of the list. And Computational, computational uh, complexity of swaps for in place algorithms, memory usage, usage uh, and use of other computer resources, recursion. Some algorithms are either recursive or non recursive, while others may be, may be uh, both. For example, merge sort. Stability. Stable sorting algorithms maintain the relative order of records with uh, equal scales or values. Whether of or not they are a comparison sort, a comparison sort examines the data only by comparing two elements with a comparison operator. General method insertion. Exchange, selection, merging. Exchange sorts as include the bubble sort and quick sort. Selection sorts include the shaker sort and hip sort. About the, about the property of stability, when the cards are sorted by rank with a table sort, the two fives must remain in the same order in the sorted output that they were originally in. When they are sorted with a non-stable sort, the fives may end up in the opposite order in the sorted output. This is a summary of the main uh, algorithms and their properties. We have two grid groups of sorting algorithms. Under the classification by computational complexity, worst, average and best behavior. Then in terms of the size of the list and for typical serial sorting algorithms, good behavior is in the order of n times log n, with parallel sort in order of log to n, and bad behavior is in the order of n squared. Ideal behavior for a serial sort is in the order of n. But it is not easy. It is not possible in the average case. Optimal parallel sorting is in 
the order of log n and comparison based sorting algorithms need at least in the order of n times log n comparisons for most inputs. Here we can see the main algorithms under the rubric of comparison sort. Classification, criteria, complexity. Quick sort and merge sort are traded in the chapter apart. Linear sort, linear sort um, also are traded in the another chapter. Bubble sort. Bubble sort algorithm works by comparing each item in the list with the item next to it and swapping them if required. In other words, the larger element was, uh, has bubbled to the top of the array. The algorithm repeats the process and the lead makes a pass all the way through the list uh, with, without uh, swapping any items. We can see in the image these considerations. Selection sort algorithm works by selecting the smallest unsorted item and then swapping it with the item in the next position to be filed. The selection sort works as follows. You look through the entire, entire array for the smallest element and you find you, you swap it, the smallest element, with the first element of the array. Then you look off for the smallest element in the remaining array or array without the first element and swap it in the second element. Then you look for the smallest, uh, smallest element in the remaining array, an array between, without the first and second elements, and swap it in the third element, and so on. We can see this recursion of swapping elements. A tree sort is a sort algorithm that builds a binary search tree for the from the elements to be sorted and then traverses the tree in order so that the elements come out in sorted order. Is typical use or in, in sorting elements adaptively. After each insertion, the set of elements seen so far is available in sorted order. We can see. On the left, yes. On the right, no. And the small list. Heap sort. The heap sort algorithm can be divided into two parts. In the first step, a heap is built out of the data. The heap is often placed in an array with the layout of the complete binary tree. The complete binary tree maps the binary tree structure into the array indices. Each array index represents a node, the index of the node's parent, left child branch, or right child branch, are simple expression. For a zero-based array, the road node is uh, stored at index zero. If i is the index of the current node, 
then in the second step the sorted array is created uh, by rapidly moving the largest element for the, from the hip, the root of the hip, and inserting into the array. The hip is updated after each removal to maintain the hip. Once all objects and has been removed from the hip, the result is sorted array. Hip sort can be performed in place. The array can be split into two parts, the sorted array and the heap. The storage of heaps is arrays in the diagram. The heaps in are preserved after each extraction. So the only cost is that of extractions. The heap sort algorithm uh, involves preparing the list by first turning in the max heap. The algorithm then repeatedly swaps the first value of the list with the last value, decreasing the range of values considered in the heap operation by one and shifting the new, the new first value into this position in the heap. This repeats until the range of considered values is one value in length. And the sources.